So here we are in the um, elevator, and there we are, seventh floor, top floor. We come out of the elevator, and there are a number of apartments on this floor, including the apartment in question. So now we're going through the door, and here we are on the right hand side. We see storage and video entry phone. And here is the hallway. That's the noise of the door closing behind me. Here's the hallway. You can see the lights and you can see all the doors off the hallway to the other rooms. Um, the first room we'll have a look at is the bathroom right here. There's the WC, there's the floor tiles, there's the towel rail, the baby bath, which you may use if you want to. Here's the sink and cupboards under the sink and a mirror. And here is, oh, there's the window. And here is the bath and the shower. It's a power shower, so it works quite nicely. In fact, we'll just put it on for a moment. How about that? And here's another cabinet in the bathroom for storage. That's the, um, it's the bathroom mat which has just been washed, so it's hanging up to dry. And next we'll go, that's the baby's push chair. Next we'll go to the kitchen, which might be a bit of a mess uh, as we've been cooking today. Here's the kitchen, coffee pot, cupboards, extractor fan, uh, gas hob, electric oven, fridge and freezer. Deep fat fryer, herb rack, there's the outdoors. You can see North London that way. It's quite a good view. There's a fire escape there. Uh, the garbage is right here. And outside is the chute where you put the garbage. You can just see the chute there. And here we have more kitchen, more cupboards bread making machine, baby bottle steriliser, you probably won't want to use that, kettle, sink, washing machine down there in the corner, it's a washer dryer, there's a dishwasher, uh, which I didn't show you, and now we'll go to the airing cupboard, the airing cupboard is full of stuff, like airing cupboards are, so we don't go in there often, and then we go to the second bedroom, and in the second bedroom we have a wardrobe and drawers. The second bedroom is currently set up for a seven-year-old boy. So it's got a child-sized bed, good for up to a ten-year-old. But as you can see, there's a lot of space in here, so we can put up another bed. And there's space for an air bed on the floor as well. Cupboards and books and stuff. Uh, a nice light room with um, Venetian blinds and a blackout blind behind that. And now we'll go to the master bedroom. Master bedroom, just like the second bedroom, has recently been redecorated. And here it is. You can see the curtains. This room faces north. There's a computer right there, but that will be all cleared away. And fitted cupboards all the way around these two walls. Um, so lots and lots and lots of wardrobe space. One, two, three. And more cupboards and drawers on this side too. We have um, 
chest of drawers. Ignore the big black suitcase that's going on vacation with us. Uh, the window faces north, um, so you get to see all kinds of stuff going on there. Uh, this is the baby's cradle, and here is the main bed. It's a Louis XV Repro, about 120 years old, so not actually Louis XV, but you know, almost as good. Arguably, maybe better. And finally, we'll leave the master bedroom. We'll turn the light out on the way. Past the washing into the living room. This is the main living room. Again, a nice, light, bright room. You can see we've got a rocking chair in there right now. We've got a desk. We've got a whole load of cupboards with books and music and CDs and goodness knows what else. Uh, in the corner we have the hi-fi and stereo, CD player, radio, record decks, goodness knows what. Um, under here we have things like the wireless internet access, uh, a colour printer which you're welcome to try and use and we have a dining table right here which is a fold out table one leaf open right there and a little fruit bowl and over here in the far corner of the room we have a 37 inch flat screen TV with a DVD player and cable TV with free view so there's quite a lot of channels which is always nice. There's a music stand in case you need to rehearse. Uh, fireplace, well, mock fireplace. Uh, music corner. And uh, a, a nice, sumptuous heels leather sofa. And here we are again. Excuse me, somebody just stepped into view. I can ignore them. So here we are, back out, past the kitchen, back into the hallway, and towards the door. And thank you very much for watching.